Okay, guys, welcome back to Topic Tuesday. Oh, I didn't even realize. Okay, just ignore the smudge and mascara. Did I ever wear mascara yesterday? Anyway, okay, so today I'm here with Maisie, even though she's on my windowsill. Um, and I'm going to show you guys my makeup palettes. Because I mentioned in a couple videos ago that I would just for fun. So I'm going from oldest to newest. So yeah. Okay, so my aunt mostly provided me with most of my makeup that I got as a kid. Well, as a young teenager. I don't know. Because my mom didn't want me to wear makeup. Which is like decent. But once I got into like grade 8 I was like hey but like everyone's wearing makeup but anyway so I got this from Avon which I don't know if this is going to turn around so you can see um and it's a pretty it's pretty thick but that is because okay so first off that is kind of how it is and then um you can take out these little woo, Okay. <laughs> anyway, and then it kind it opens. I don't. How do I? Ah! So once again, it's it's a really like yucky kind of because like it's so old. But then that is also parts of it. Um, and then it has like a little drawer drawer um, that has this little thing. Which is a little baby palette that you can take like to go. And it has some more things in it. And there's brushes in here. This brush, which actually hurts to put on your face. And it's really gross. And it has this little brush. <laughs> and then it had one of those like smudging um, eyeshadow brushes that literally no one uses. Um, but anyway... That was my first makeup palette, and I, like, took it everywhere. I didn't use it much, but I loved it anyway. Okay, so then another thing, uh, my second makeup palette was, again, from my aunt. Um, because I saw it, and I was like, yo, that's so cool. And then it was on sale, so then she bought it, because she sells Avon, so she gets me a lot of stuff from there. And... So, the palette looks like this. So, it has tiny little windows that you can, like, see the colors from and whatever. And then you open it up, and it looks like that. So, it's really cool because they're all, like, marbled. Um, and then they're pretty sheer, but they're, like, really sparkly. So, I swatched one on my hand. Okay, that's not really working, <laughs> but, um, yeah, no. Okay, so, there we go. Don't mind my scratch right there. Um, and then, if I swatch another one, maybe one that will be easier to see. Okay, what about this, like, dark purple one? Okay, so, that's kind of yeah and then ooh, that came out a little chunky okay so that's more of like one of the matte ones that like isn't as glittery and then it comes with one of these like smudging things that no one uses we're chilling um anyway but I do really like this and it's one of the things that like I can show to my friends and they'll be like yo that's really cool and I'm like thank you I know Okay, <laughs> um, I had to do my, um, taping on my iPad, <laughs> so I'm currently holding it up with, um, like, one of my sand jar things. Anyway, so I'm trying to, like, see around it. Um, okay, so my third oldest is a palette from e.l.f., one of these little baby palettes. And it was from 
Abby for Christmas, I think. And it's the rose gold one. Yeah. And it's been used a few times. And it looks like this. Um, and it's not like, I don't know. It's good, but I haven't used it as much. Even though, like, these are colors I wear normally. I, I honestly don't know why I haven't used it that much. But I don't really wear much, like, eyeshadow. And, like, this is super easy to just, like, pop in a traveling bag. Why do I not? Okay, anyway. <laughs> um, so. We're on to my fourth one. Um, okay, so I went on a trip about a year ago. Uh, to Toronto. And... Boom. The James Charles palette. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, I was really, I used to like watch James Charles a lot. Um, and then once like the whole scandal happened, I was kind of like, ugh. Because I didn't know really what side to take, so like I, di I just dipped. Um, but I mean, I kind of like the palette. It's not as like... Like, okay, it's pigmented, but it's, like, hard to get from pan to on your face. Like, you can rub your finger, and, okay, here's an example. Um, okay, so I'll rub my finger on this green one. And as you can see, like, it looks really pigmented, right? But then, like... It also looks really pigmented on my wrist, but if you were to take a brush and try to put it on your eyelid, it doesn't really like transfer well. I don't even know if I could... Like it transfers okay with like your finger, but I don't think I would... Like, I mean, that's a, that's a good look. But, it's hard because it's like, nah, I use brushes. I wonder if I should show. Okay, I'll show an example. Okay. Just a normal makeup brush. Okay, guys. Okay. What color should I use? Um, let's do, um... Let's try this gold one. Okay, so the one that I just watched was this green one. This green sparkle one. Now I'm going to do this gold one. I basically am a makeup guru right now, okay? Okay. So as you can see, there's not, like, a lot on it. Oh, I'm scared that this isn't going to... Okay. Okay, so like, it's like really sheer. I mean, maybe that's just because it's like almost the same color as my eyelid. I don't know. But either way, wait, what is this doing? That's rude. Either way, it like, I don't know. I feel like it got too much clout um, for like the overall result. But, if you want a colorful palette, and like a very versatile palette, here it is. I wish they added, like they added like a gold, but they didn't really add like a silver. And I love silver eyeshadow, so anyway. Okay. This one is probably my favorite and most used palette. It's from ColourPop. I love ColourPop. Their palettes... Are like so good and same with like their lip gloss and everything is kind of cheap um but it's like good like it's not like cheap like cheaply made it's like cheap like money wise mm -hmm. someone just texted me uh, okay anyway oh I have to like move so much do I have a pillow I have a pillow okay wait. oh there we go okay so anyway it's the Disney designer 
um, palette and it has like some Disney princesses on it and I love Disney princesses um, and then it has like all of the names on the back anyway so then you open it up it's so dirty because I use it so much um it's a very like versatile palette um because it's mostly like neutral like I mean it's not bright and colorful but it does have like like this color is like the brightest color here or like this color and they're really pigmented too not gonna lie um like that is exactly why I've not touched the black because <laughs> I touched it like once and my whole entire eyelid was black and I was like Ooh. um but anyway so this is my favorite palette and I love it um and I take it everywhere with me yay okay I got these three in a pack for Christmas and they're from Smashbox and they're my first like Smashbox things and honestly like they're pretty good I take them with me a lot of places too so it's this one is an eye palette and it's like more of like a not neutral eye palette um so I've used a few of these they're pretty good quality actually and I I really like them this one's a face one oh my gosh okay so this one's a highlight this one's oh this one's a blush and then this one's a bronzer and they have the names again on the back and they're kind of like all like space themed and I don't know okay maybe not that one where is the one that okay well like the little things like move okay maybe <laughs> the video is not gonna pick it up just kidding guys um anyway and then there's this third one hey don't chew my mirror man um and they all come with like a mirror and the mirror is pretty good um but yeah i really liked these my grandparents got them for me the pack so yeah i love i love these okay and they're actually pretty like kind of heavy like just perfect like do do okay anyway <laughs> um oh what time is it okay and then my last palette that i got is called winter nights and it's from a brand called uh alouette and alouette is like vegan i think it's vegan um it's cruelty free gluten free vegan friendly and recyclable are all of these things this too uh that does not say this one says cruelty free either way um and it's made with like organic products like um aloe vera and stuff and so it looks like this oh my gosh i don't know okay so this is like the cheek side and this is like the eye side of the palette um and some of these i haven't used yet because i just got it this winter but like i've used this blush and i've used this highlight um and i don't know what these ones are for because like this is like a purple so like are people into like purple blush i don't know and then this one's like i don't know it's like a reddish gold so i don't know I don't know what it is. Maybe it's for like people with darker skin. Um, anyway. And then it has like the six little things over here. And it smells like chocolate. Kinda. I don't know, it smells sweet. 
um, and it has the, uh, the names too, and I mean, it's not, like, it's pretty, like, pigmented, um, this one right here, oh, little chunks, um, but yeah, I don't know, I really like that one, and it's, like, good for winter. So yeah, that is, oh, okay, I'm gonna have to wash, this is a good eye look for sure, I'm gonna have to wash my hands, anyway, um, but yeah, those are all of my palettes, um, I've only bought two out of ten, <laughs> but that's okay. I also had another palette from Monica that she gave me, and I don't know where that went, <laughs> but it was another e.l.f. palette, and it was Baked Shadow, and it wasn't very pigmented, and it was hard to get onto a brush, um, so I don't really recommend that e.l.f. Um, palette, but like the other ones seem to be okay so far. Anyway, this video is getting long. Maisie, do you want to say bye to people? Maisie! Come here. Oh, she's here. Are you going to say bye? Say bye. Bye! <laughs> Mwah. Oh, my little baby. Anyway, um, I have to go back to schoolwork now. And I hope everyone is doing okay in quarantine. Um, yeah. This is a really cute <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm sorry. Bye, guys. Oh. <laughs> I'm really hyper. Okay. Bye. Stay safe.